Storm and a win clear from Carl Forsman. He has almost no one in shot here as he comes into the last five meters. It's going to be goal for Ponce Bertrand of Spain. And he touches in 128.57. And wow, that is an excellent time. It is a world record time. That was a sensational swim from Antonio Ponce Bertrand. Gold and silver is going to go to Borgioni or Cech. They are strong for stroke. They're coming into the flags, into the red markers. It looks like Cheng might just take it here. It's going to be tight, and it is. Cheng will take it in 46.51. It's a world record time for Cheng. And Borgioni also inside the old world record, 46.86. But it's silver for the Italian with Deng the bronze medal position, but it's gold to China, gold to Chang in a world record time. But Lopez Diaz is holding on here, the Mexican crowd really getting excited here as they come into the last five meters. It's the number three, it's Lopez Diaz, it is going to be gold to Mexico. It's Diego Lopez Diaz, is the champion in 46.38. There is the Mexican winner, Diego Lopez Diaz, in a championship record 46.38. And I don't know about the Mexican crowd getting excited, but I got too excited then. And it looks like Andre Brazil is going to retain that title again, and he does. It's 52.60. It is gold to Andre Brazil. It's a fifth straight world title from Andre. It's all going to be in the finish. Chen is just about holding on and she reaches for the wall and Scotty Trini gets it by two one hundredths of a second. But what a finish from Alessia Scotty Trini to take gold for Italy. And it looks like it is silver to Karimi, the independent participant there in 42.35. What a spin from him. Mohamed Ali Karimi independent participant here at the World Championships. Born in Afghanistan, he was a refugee now living in the USA in Portland. What a swim from that young man.